Okay, so the next uh, uh, tab here on the table here is going to be oil pressure protect table. And this is going to be set uh, so that we can cut our engine off uh, based on this oil pressure uh, in this table. So uh, first we're going to have to enable this feature uh, going up to our wizard section here. Set up wizard engine protection. And we're going to scroll down here and we're going to set our oil pressure protection basic setup. We're going to click this oil protection enable. We're going to have an activation delay and a protect rev limiter. So uh, in this delay it's going to wait 1.5 seconds or 1500 milliseconds uh, for the oil pressure to drop below whatever is programmed here. So uh, at this particular engine RPM uh, we would have to have uh, this oil pressure or higher or else it will uh, wait for this uh, 1.5 mil, uh, seconds or 1500 milliseconds before it would start to rev limit the engine here at 3000 RPM. Uh, so we might want to have our oil pressure protect basic setup set something very low. Instead of 3,000 RPM, we want the engine to shut off. So if we set it to something like 200 RPM, that would effectively go ahead and uh, shut our engine right down if it uh, drops below the threshold we program here. Um, so there's going to be a bit of a strategy to uh, program this table, and it's fairly simple. But uh, first, let's go ahead. I'm going to add in this window, and you can do this as well, text grid, set channels. We can go into uh, our we type pressure, and then we're going to select our actual oil pressure, oil pressure PSIG. Now this is going to assume we have already fitted the engine with an oil pressure sensor, and in this case I have, and I'm building uh, 60 PSI oil pressure here at 4000 RPM. 